What's up guys, today we are going to check out this dude. He is basically an anime protagonist, okay? Why are all Japanese people anime protagonists? When am I going to be an anime protagonist? I'm always a side character, come on. Jun's Kitchen, they're not even a aquarium fish tank YouTuber, but they are destroying the competition. Everything he does is aesthetically pleasing. Just take a look at this opening. Where am I? I'm in the movie theater. Look at that. Straight out of Studio Ghibli, just riding his bike. He's got a cat on his bike. Whose cat is on a bike? That's called a dog. Just parking his bike with a cat in it. That's so cute. John, you are a handsome devil. He just ordered his cat to hop off his bike. Comment below if your cat can do that. And the cat is just following him. Tell me that's not an anime protagonist. Did he train his cat to do that? Is his cat a paid actor? No. He is in an anime. This is a slice of life anime. He is getting inspiration from nature because he has that Keke Ginkai Amano Takashi blood in him. That Kakashi Am Takashi. Let's just go with Kakashi, I said it. Kakashi Amano, rest in peace, blood in him. Inspired by nature, Aqua Design Amano. That's what it is. He just picks up some twigs and he's gonna make magic with them, okay? Because he's best husbando SSR super super rare gachapult right here. Now he's at the grocery store buying cilantro. What is that? Don't tell me you can just find aquascaping plant seeds at the grocery store in Japan, what? And those aren't SpongeBob fish tanks. Those are ADA level amazing works of art. Are you kidding me? What kind of culture is this? He's getting some greens for lunch later and whatever that is. We got some ADA clear glass right here, just in the grocery store. Got some hydroponics going on. What's it gonna do? Hey guys. Hi Jun. He is so handy. He's a handy man. Rachel, his wife. You pulled an SSR, nay, you pulled an LR, Legendary Rare, on your first pull. This is a one-of-a-kind YouTube channel. He's making an IKEA furniture with his cats. Oh, so cute. He's so understanding of the cats. He's so patient with them. He treats them just like his own children. <laughs> catfish. <laughs> Spe new species of catfish. Oh, he's using aqua soil. Yo, this guy knows what's up. Dude, the cats in the back are so cute. Oh my goodness. The way he's washing the rocks, it's just all so calming, so aesthetically pleasing, his videos. Hey, a center part, bro. No, I bet he's putting some white substrate right in the middle of that center part. This guy knows what he's doing. Hydrophila, okay. All right, so here is something to contest with. Now, I'm in Canada. If I order some hydrophila, seeds from aliexpress or alibaba or even amazon most of them are hydrophila polysperma now they don't specifically tell you these subspecies like polysperma and that's quite shady of them because let me tell you right now most of them are the polysperma kind where after their initial sprout of baby plants they just go full they even go as tall as immersed they grow right out of the water and that's not a carpet anymore so they scam you like that but they're in japan so i I'm, I'll tend to believe that that is actually some carpeting species of hygrophila, which is amazing. Wow, even his mist. Curious? What does he use to mist? It, it sounds so satisfying. Sprout. I hope they sprout too, Jen. Just for you, baby. Ugh, why is Jen so, so handsome? I can't, I can't handle it. His cats are so, so mentally stimulated every day because Jen's always up to new things. Jen is an artist, okay? He is number one husbando best artist, most handsome guy. He's a wood carver now. He's also a barber. Well, oh, he's doing hydroponic for real. Dang, drainage layer going on. Ah, see, river sand. We got some white substrate, just like I said, just like I anticipated. I'm a genius too, right, Jun? Most of the time, cats don't care about anything, right? They're not like interested in you. You're not just not that interesting. But when it comes to Jun, Nagi. Nagi, stop shaking the tripod, dude. Let Jun work. Let the magic man do his magic. Wow, what a cool perspective. So cute. The cats are pretty cute too. Dude, this tank came together. Look at that. Look at that gorgeous carpet. Ah, <sighs> This guy is running the show here. He's, he's a cooking channel. It's called Jun's Kitchen. And he's doing more than I will ever do. He's high-fiving his cats. 
He's got this 5 out of 5 fish tank. Yeah, it's 5 out of 5. Were you ever gonna doubt it? Kabamba, he knows the names of these plants. Who is he? Who are you, Jun? Seriously, were you were you Amano Takashi in your past life? Oh my goodness. He's got a CO2 system. Say hello to Thunder. Hi Thunder. Thunder's so cute. How is this better? It's so cute. <laughs> is it just me or like is everything that Jun does just amazing? I'm fangirling so hard right now, you don't even know. Salvinia! My favorite floater plant! Salvinia! Wow, he's, he's even got the circles going! Provide some air exchange, because the Salvinia just takes over, you know what I'm saying? Hey, if it's endorsed by Jun, go get yourself some Salvinia, okay? Don't trust my word. My word is nothing compared to this guy, but if this guy is even using Salvinia, must be the best floater plant out there. He could have used frog bit, duckweed. Nope, Salvinia. What's going on here? He just shoved something into the sponge. Put some tissues. Oh, he's propagating them. They're going to germinate. Sprouts. Ooh, bean sprouts, right? For his hydroponic system. Okay, there has never been a successful hydroponic system on fish tank review yet. But this is that successful system. Oh, that's what it was that he was buying. Okay, one day with Jun versus three days with Jun. The difference is uncanny. They're delicious. You're delicious. Transparent fish can be really stressful. Oh no. Thunder, no. Oh, he healed already. Amato shrimp! And the Marino moss ball. Oh, my boy is lit. He knows what's up. Who is he? Jun, who are you? Wow, Thunder. You hear that, Rose? Why can't you be more like Thunder, Rose? Okay, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. That's... Some PTSD from parenting. Oh, he's even stimulating. Oh, I should do that for Rosé. Oh, why am I such a failure compared to Jun? Uh, he's just making an omelet for Rachel when she gets back home from work. Rachel, you lucky dog. Rachel, you better cherish this boy. You better cherish your uh, LR husbando. How many girls are jealous of Jun? Let me just get. Let me just get a get a consensus right now. Comment below if you're trying to roll a Jun. If you're trying to re-roll Jun as your husbando. See you guys later. Oh no, see you, John. Oh, John's leaving us. See you next time. You know what? I take it back. Studio Ghibli, he's not living in a Studio Ghibli movie. Studio Ghibli is taking inspiration from him. He is where the films took inspiration from. I mean, look at that stuff, man. What? That's so scenic. That's so picturesque. Where do you find a guy like this? How, how can I become more like Jun? I got three tanks back there and none of them match what he just did. He put a bonsai tree in an aquarium. Come on, five out of five, six out of five. Let's go. Moral of the story is I will always just be a side character. But hey, maybe this is a spinoff. Maybe Fish for Thought is a spinoff series and I'm fine with spinoffs. In some gacha games, the three to four star characters are still playable and can still go through the game. Some people might even find that more fun. Okay, <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and hit that like button, do all that jazz, because there'll be more videos to come, and don't forget to get your hands wet.